me. John, is that you? Yeah. Do you remember to get my dress? Yeah. You're home a little early, aren't you? Yeah. How was your day? Fine. I got you a pizza, too. I had a real bad day. Yeah, yeah, I bet you did. I quit my job. Al, I just can't take this anymore. I know, I gotta straighten out. This is ridiculous. Right? That's what you said last week. You know how much he's straightened out in just one week. It hasn't been a week, John. It's been six months. Nothing's changed. And you sleep till noon, then you watch Rocky and Bullwinkle, then you drive your cab, what, a couple of hours? You come home, you order up food, then you play those stupid Tito Puente albums till two in the morning. Tito Puente is gonna be dead, and you'll say, I've been listening to him for years, and I think he's fabulous. Uh-huh, right. Then you watch movies until dawn, and then, then you come to bed with me. You don't think that takes energy? You're a sexual dynamo. Most guys couldn't even handle you. I've been reading books on the outside just so I can keep up with you. It's not funny. You're going nowhere, John. It's just not that cute anymore. It's a little cute. Come on. I'm part of a lost and restless generation. What, you want me to run for the Senate? I don't know what I want. I just know I don't want you. The basic problem is I'm still around. Where's that sharp knife we have? I need a... I need you. No. I knew that wouldn't be so good. John, no, it's not gonna work. Look, I like you, but I need something more. I need someone who's gonna develop and grow with me. Goodbye. Who could grow more than me? Goodbye, John. Talk about massive potential for growth. I'm the acorn that becomes the oak. You can't go! All the plants are gonna die! And then depression sets in. Hi, John. What's the matter? Nothing. What kind of dirty work? Punch. One shot, John. Hey, can I take your last beer? two hours, I've lost my job, my apartment, my car, and my girlfriend. You still have your health. This doesn't look bad. What? The army? You're kidding. No, I've always thought about joining the army. Bullshit. You're not the type. What do you mean I'm not the type? I've seen the guys that enlist the army. I saw them when I was working on unemployment. They're just like us, except they're not as sophisticated. Yeah, they're not as old either. I bet you can't do five push-ups. Five push-ups? I got three dollars. Says that I can do five push-ups. Okay, let's go. Five good ones, come on. Not marine push-ups. No, simple push-ups. <clears throat> I've never heard bones creak like that. <sighs> That's none. I'm praying. You ought to. Now let's go. There's a time limit here. He's almost set. 
He's eyeing that rug. And that's one. All right, he's off. He's moving now. That's two. Not that good though. That's three. I think you're ready for the Special Olympics. That's three. Four. Four. I was testing you. And here goes five. Will he do it? Congratulations. You just doubled your money. I gotta get in shape. I gotta dry out. I'll be dead before I'm 30. The army's my only chance. You could join a monastery. Did you ever see a monk screw around with some teenage girls? Never. So much for a monastery.